now here you will see that there is a users table i am going to the users table and here are all the fields of the users table if i go to see the migration for this i am going to check the migration so i am going to database then migrations and then there is a users table this was actually the migration file so in this migration file you see that the field names are name email email verified at password etc now what i will do i will just add here uh, as this is a multi authentication system so in order to authenticate who is user login i will have to create some user roles so here after for example after the password i am going to create the new user roles so i am going to create here enum and here i am going to create here role so here i am going to add an admin role and in the full system there can be another role for example that is customer and also there can be another role uh, for example vendor when i will show you the application uh, i will go to the live application to work then i may need to edit these roles but for but for now i am just going to place total three roles okay one is admin another one is customer and another one is vendor and i am going to tell which one is default that is default when a user will sign up his role will be set up as the customer role okay so it's good uh, there is no issue here and another thing i am going to add that is for example a status so i am going to copy this line and here i am going to tell here another role that is a status uh, not role actually another field that is a status and a status can be active or inactive so when a user will uh, come here and log in then he will normally be inactive until he verify his email so here i am just going to make the default status is inactive so okay my task is uh, done for now and these two extra fields i want to add in this table so what i will do i am just going to run the migrate again but i will have to use the migrate fresh so php artisan migrate then fresh enter so the table will again be regenerated if i now refresh the users table you will see that the role and status these two new extra fields come here i am going to the structure and you will see that this is the role and this is the status role is admin customer vendor this is the role type and here you will see that the attribute default attribute is uh, this one and the status is active and inactive and the default attribute is inactive